I haven't heard of the Fine Arts Center before until I became a CC student. So we've had classes here, we've had tours here, we have students working here. It's something that definitely can grow and just continue to keep the CC students involved. So I come from a family where we have many, we do arts and crafts just for a hobby and that's something that is part of our culture and our, our identity. You know, I grew up watching my great grandma um, do Navajo rug weaving, so I picked that up. Watching my dad doing painting and airbrushing and my mom uh, making jewelry and beading. Well definitely in 2016 we had, this is when myself and a few other members of our indigenous community took our trip to the um, Standing Rock Reservation to join the, the No Dapple movement. I was one of the students that was asked to talk about the experience. It was joined with another exhibit about resistance. Um, I really could relate to that because that's some of the work and advocacy um, I work with. And then there was just many opportunities as a student to help you know put the costumes together to go behind the scenes to do different workshops with the costume fabrication myself and another um, native student had been asked by Virgil to do some modeling at Garden of the Gods so you couldn't tell it was me and, and my friend that were in the video because we have the the masks on but we get to say oh yeah that's the one we we were dressed up as you know we always love coming here with my family and I just specifically to see the native art that's here, all the different tribes that are represented. You know, it's beautiful to see that every time we come here to the Fine Arts Center.